Hi everybody, I'm back and I'm going to be doing a quick review, hopefully quick, on all these mascaras. Um, this is just a quarter of the mascaras that I have. Um, I have a ginormous, I'm working on, <clears throat> excuse my voice, I'm catching a cold. I'm working on uh, cleaning out my ball game room. Yeah, as you can see, my Lush is over here, which is crazy. Yeah, you can see it's piled up on the floor. Yeah, that's part of it. Anyway, I have a really cool product that I'm going to order. You guys are going to be astounded. This, this product is really cool. It's really expensive, but I think that uh, once you guys see it, you won't be able to live without it. It is just amazing. It, it will make anybody's home just beautiful. Anyway, so let's get going with these um, mascaras. So first I have, first of all, I have IT Cosmetics. So here it is. Never been used. Let me fix my Betsy Johnson watch. I'm kind of wishing I would have gotten a black one. I knew, I knew that Anthony would have said you should have gotten a black one, but anyway, so yeah, pink, black, whatever, so, okay, so here, this one is clinically proven to increase lash volume by 40, 430%, and it's not, it's cruelty free and not tested on animals. Now, one thing I like about this is it's got, um, it's got kind of a, it's not, it's got like a skid, it's got like a, what's the word? It's not skid proof, so it won't slide out of your hands. But you have to, to know, in order to know how good your mascara is going to be, you have to see, you have to look at the brush and see how wet it's going to be. Um, excuse me. And usually if it's going to be, like this one seems to be like it's going to be really wet is what I'll do is I'll open it like this and leave it open up overnight one night if you leave it more than one night it will dry out um so yeah um my eyes aren't looking real good just because it's evening time and it's time to take my mascara off but um this one's a little bit wet so yeah so this is the It Cosmetics. Probably not one of my not one of my favorites. And then I have a whole bag of It Cosmetics that I need to go through. I've been promising you guys, promising you guys. Um, if you don't cancel, they will keep sending you boxes and boxes and boxes. And there's no way to get through all this stuff. They, there's Bye Bye Cores, and then I have two. Two of these, um, there's a highlight brush and a bronzer, they come in like a flying saucer, that's what I call them, I mean they're really nice products, but there's no way you can get through these, unless you carry one in your purse, but when you have a coach purse, you need to make sure that you have, if you have a high end purse like a Louis, Louis Vuitton, coach, whatever, you need to make sure that you have a really good makeup bag. Otherwise, if it leaks through, something leaks through, your bag is done. Okay, so we will go through the It Cosmetics later. So, yeah. And then it comes with two um, Vitality Lip Blush 4-in-1 Reviver. I mean, this, this is not really a... It's more of a lip conditioner. I wash my face and I put it on at night. Just kind of like a Vaseline, and just put it on. It's really soft. Your lips are chapped. Yeah, it does have a little bit of a pink tinge. You can see the pink. It does. It actually. Wow. I never noticed that. It does kind of adjust to the color of your skin. Or it's really pretty, actually. I never noticed that. Whoops, I just bent it. You never roll your, you never, you never want to roll your, uh, lipsticks out that far, or you will bend them. But, anyway, you can see how it's turned a light pink. It's really pretty, so, 
have two of these in there. So let's go back. Let's go back to the mascaras. And I will give you my top five. Okay, we'll, we'll come back to the It Cosmetics in another video. This is, this box is just shoved full. And then I still have the Charlotte Tilbury and the QVC advent calendars that I haven't unloaded from Christmas. Yeah, crazy. But everybody was doing it, so I figured I might as well wait. So, this came in a box. This came, I think, in the FabFitFun box. Don't quote me. This is Blanc voluminous um uh feline and you can see the brush and it's black jet black um i have not tried this yet so let's see what it looks like i like the packaging it's really nice packaging now this is like a drugstore um now this one seems to be a little bit drier, and that's what I like. Um, a lot of the mascara brushes are not the way they used to be. They used to be really, um, they used to have long, 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 long. I'm wearing false eyelashes, so you can't really see well. I don't want to have 17 different eyelashes, 17 different mascaras on my eyes right now, but... But this is a nice one. I would probably put this on my top five. So I'm going to keep this up here. Because it's a, it tends to be a drier mascara. And that's what I like. The wet ones seem to make your eyelashes clump together. As far as what I've seen. And this is another cover girl. This is ten times the volume. This is another favorite of mine. I haven't opened it yet. But, um, as you can see, the brush, it has a little spiky, and this one tends to be a little bit drier. It has a lid, um, where you unscrew it, and then you screw in your mascara. So, yeah, this one is Lash Blast Volume. So, this is probably my second favorite. And then, here is Voluminous Primer Base. Now... I'm not quite sure, uh, volumizing brush, um, this goes on clear, it's L'Oreal, um, I'm not sure if, let's see what it says on the back, our first mascara primer to expand the limits of your outer lashes, coats for visibly thicker lashes and a smoother mascara application, so I have not tried this yet, um, does not smudge, removes easily with soap and water, so, this may be a great product, so I will have to be on the fence on this until I try it. But this came in another beauty box. So we'll put this over here on my top five. Um, and then I have a whole bag. These are all brand new. Now, um, I have duplicates of some of these. Here is the Roller Lash by Benefit. This one is not a favorite of mine. This, oops, 